Hey, that's not how I blend it. It should be black. Come on in, guys. Who was that? <laughs> Hi. I always drive past this place. It's called Bakery and Cafe. It actually has a name. <laughs> I forget. I forgot totally how it's called. I've never gone in there and I need a coffee. I want a proper coffee. I want something. I need something. And let's see what they have. Yuri, that's your death. Look at that. And a coffee. They also sell uh, bread and stuff over there and uh, pasta. Very good afternoon, almost night even. It was not an excuse for me to sleep very late. But um, I haven't had any sleep in the past week even. Uh, we had so much stuff to do and I didn't really talk about it on the vlog at all because I just totally forgot to vlog. Also because it was very busy during the day. It basically meant that I had like two to three hours of sleep every single day, even the past two days when I was uh, in Amsterdam. Last night I was like, fuck it, I'm just sleeping until I get awake. I'm not even putting an alarm on. We'll just see how things go. And uh, I slept pretty good. I was happy about that. You might also have noticed that Sarah wasn't in the vlogs the past few days because she wasn't feeling as, uh, as good as she wanted to be. And also I said, well, I'm in Amsterdam and I hope that I have enough footage during the day to be able to make a, a good vlog out of it. So with that said, let's start off the night. <laughs> I have to edit a lot of the vlogs. Uh, Sarah has been picking those up, also with the reason of me being able to edit them. I was so not myself the last two days. I never had this like that. It was really, really, really bad. I think Yuri was at some point like, what the hell should I do? <laughs> and I'm like, yes. <laughs> the problem is our neighbors, for example, they do have bad bugs or had bad bugs. They got rid of them, but they were worried that they would spread. So I went on vacation, came back, was lying in my bed and everything was like tickling and I was like, ah, but I couldn't find any bad bugs. Um, later on, because I couldn't sleep, I was waking up every 30 minutes and I was just a wreck. And technically spoken crazy so later on i looked up insomnia and bed bugs and also read about they technically can make you crazy and i was like oh my god i probably have bed bugs <laughs> but i couldn't find any so right now i'm like i will just uh, when i come home i will clean up everything i will look everywhere just see if there's something and then I just get it out of my head because there is nothing. Period. Instead of downloading the footage every single day to our hard disks, I just kept recording every single day. I know it's a little bit bad, but when you come home at 2 a.m. in the morning and you just have till 6, you're like, yeah, <laughs> that will come tomorrow. And uh, I actually had an arrangement made with uh, the person that I was supposed to be uh, filming with. He said, like, well, dude, no problem. If you need to edit something or if you need to upload, just tell me and uh, you can take some time off in the meantime. But uh, we just didn't have the option to do that. I think during the entire day, we had maybe five to ten minutes every time. And we were running around, switching things and moving stuff and setting up cameras again. So, yeah, that wasn't really working that well. But I had an awesome, awesome week. I, uh, it was tiring. It was very intense, but it was a lot of fun to do, though. For those who are worried, I do have a mount for my camera, but sometimes it came off because it was so hot outside and the stuff here started melting and then the camera just fell down. When I was just standing in a red light or so, I have it in my hand, not often, sometimes. Additionally, I wasn't really able to eat anything in the last days I tried and I was like, oh. so it was, it was just like stressed out. And I think the whole not resting after coming back, it's like, hey, you're going on vacation and then you need a vacation from the vacation. <laughs> Plus the whole outlook that we have no clue what's happening right now. But good thing is in the last couple of days, some ideas and possibility and options came up. So it's looking way better now, and uh, which makes me also feel better. And this will help. She smells like a French croissant. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Definitely can go there. No, no, no. 
Also, if you're wondering why I'm just carrying this, yeah, there's a good excuse for that one too. I was Skyping with Sarah earlier on my on my little iPhone, and uh, I, in the middle of my like beer trimming part, the, the shaver, like the um, the trimmer, basically stopped working. I had to charge that, so then I had like this corner still done, and I was like, okay, you know what? We'll just wait till it's charged. And I'm I'm kind of training a little bit for November, which is happening in two months, three months, yeah. Oh, almost two months. Since the past couple of years, I have actually been cheating a little bit with uh, also having chin scruff. And that's not how Movember works exactly. And uh, I think I, I, I think I can rock it this year. It's been better. I've been getting used to it. He doesn't know that, but I'm filming him. I'm going outside to see the reaction. Very sexy. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Taking them, motherfucker. Cut it out. Since Wednesday morning, I have not seen anything on YouTube, including our own vlogs. Truthfully, I have no clue what Sarah has been up to, other than, of course, and we have been talking very shortly in between at night, and uh, of course, we WhatsApped, but the reception was so bad last week that in, when there were more than five people inside that hallway, there was no reception, and the Wi Fi was even worse because we were using the uh, staff Wi-Fi, but apparently it, it just didn't work half the time. I just could not get anything loaded, but I'm currently catching up with the vlogs. Uh, also the comments, if you've seen a couple of comments uh, with my name under it, I did see those. So <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to catch up. I'm finally starting editing because I have to sort everything from my camera. I just continued vlogging on the camera without downloading them. It works, we have really big cards in our cameras. Also because of situations like this, more than 15 minutes of vlog footage is unusable otherwise. Cutting it down is already work enough and if I translate it to the amount of footage that we shoot, I think an average vlog is per camera like 3 or 4 gigs every single day. I'm just happy that Sarah has been able to edit some of her road trip parts and uh, it's good, it's good because uh, I I totally forget the vlog. I keep telling this on the vlog, and of course the people around me like as soon as something demands my attention full time. For instance, like last week, and trust me, it was very intense. It, I was basically running around the entire day, up and down, up and down, and. Uh, I tend to forget to pull out the camera and talk. Also, because the people weren't really used to me talking in front of a camera. Uh, Yes, it is kind of a weird situation to begin with. And uh, I mean, I, I did talk for parts, but if you've noticed, I usually talk to myself and to you guys, of course. Mm, maybe maybe we should change it in the future, but it's it's just, I just don't want to make feel, people feel awkward on camera. Because what you don't see is as soon as the, turn, the camera turns off, I have to talk to them. <laughs> Not that anything weird would happen, but more or less like, it's like, the fuck just happened here? Because they don't know how to deal with that sometimes. And uh, I don't know, it's just something that uh, that is going on in my brain. Hey baby, we're going home soon. Wow, that looks... Wow! <laughs> See that guy there? <laughs> There's a, or there was a lot of dirt in there. That looks so bad, oh my god. I guess I have to go to one of the self-cleaning services and do it again. I spent too much money on cleaning that car. Oh man. Oh, I'm so tired. Uh, I got some food in between, but my stomach is still like, mm, I don't like food. And it's a bit dark here, so I'm setting up the second light and I just realized, look at that, how big the light bulb is. This is crazy. Yeah, there we go. One and number two. Well guys, it's time for me to go to bed and get some sleep. I'm going to tell you guys to have an awesome day, more than one night. It doesn't matter where you are, as long as you have an awesome day. I'm going to try to get a live stream running again, because I've been doing it for five days straight and it was awesome. Other than that, guys, have an awesome day. Bye!